Okay. So someone close to you, and that doesn't have to be emotionally or, or family-wise, friend-wise, but someone close to you in your life has wronged you somehow. And you want sweet, sweet vengeance. <laughs> Listen to that laugh. That laugh knows your pain. So <laughs> they slapped you. You want to slap them back. How can you do that and get away with it? You're going to want to grab them and probably yell. You're probably going to want to yell. That's not the way to win. That's not going to solve any issue. It's not going to fix any problem. That's not going to solve anything. It's going to make things a lot worse. And you're probably going to spend the night in jail. Don't do that. If you go around asking for vengeance, uh, doing what you can to enact it, basically taking an eye for an eye, you're going to leave the whole world blind, and you're going to end up way, way more in pain than anything they did to you left you. And you're going to be punished way more than they will. Okay? You're not going to get even with them by wronging them in return. Okay? If someone keys your car, keying theirs won't fix yours. It won't even make you feel better. Because at the end of the day, you're going to know that you're just as bad as they are for having done that thing. Even if you're never caught. It's never shown to anyone else that you are indeed... How do you say this in a nice way? Can we just call you a bad person? Okay, even if you're never caught for that, you know it. Do not lash out at people who have wronged you somehow. You know, that, sound, that might sound ridiculous to some people who have, who have lost loved ones. Okay, that's a very extreme case of what I'm talking about. I don't think I have the authority to comment on such things. But I have been screwed over by people before. Family members, roommates, friends. I've probably done my fair share of screwing people over without realizing it. Or when I did, later acknowledged it and said, Hey, I'm sorry. And they were like, Get out of my life. Luke, you terrible person. Okay. You gotta come to respect that. But right now, if you're in a situation where people are walking on you, don't walk on them back. You're not improving the living situation, the world, their lives, or even yours. If anything, you're inviting further retaliation. You're inviting further pain to come into your life. Don't do that. You won't gain anything by meeting violence with violence. Okay? It won't help. Again, what I'm talking about is interpersonal relations. I can't speak on anything bigger than that. But the point is the same. It, don't try to get revenge. Just succeed. Make your life better every day. And eventually, your success will be so large that people that are, let's say, sabotaging your day, they won't be in your life. They won't have access to your life. You will get the last laugh because you're going to go on to be amazing. And every day will be a brand new adventure. But you will not get there if you focus on screwing someone over. If you focus on getting revenge on someone. You have to focus on accomplishing your goals and providing value to others. Do you understand? If you want the world to be better to you, you have to make the world better. You know how you win? Is you succeed. You do those things that you know lead to success. Those little steps every day that take you a little bit closer to those goals that you have. And in a few days, a few months, maybe even a few years, those people won't have the ability to enter your life anymore. They'll no longer have access to you because you'll be so far ahead. The trick to get away from people who hold you back or who wrong you is not to hold them back or wrong them. It's to get ahead yourself. And you will achieve a greater revenge through that success 
than any kind of retaliation against them could ever achieve. Ever. Win by being better. Go be better. Go do better. Go become more awesome. Go be successful in your life. Go achieve your dreams. Go make your life a wonderful adventure. And you will win. In every way that matters, you will win. And you won't need revenge. You won't need some kind of vengeance for any wrongdoing they've brought into your life because you'll be too focused on how awesome your life is. Thanks for watching. Bye. And if I may. Yeah.